Hi, it's the Appleman, and today I'm going to teach you how to turn your desktop from this into this. First, you need to download the White Sands Pack. The link's in the description, so you can go directly to the website from the video. Then, open it up. Then go into Desktop, and you can close that Safari window. And right-click on that first picture and click on Set des Desktop Picture. That's that picture that our desktop's going to be at the end. So first, open up that picture. We want to crop out that blurry background, so choose the Smart Lasso and just select the background and then push Delete. Now what you want to do is click on Duplicate as PNG, and don't worry, it's still going to, still going to save the desktop picture with the blurry background. See? And there's our duplicated PNG. The next thing you want to do is push Command S, and then save it somewhere where you'll be able to use it later on. Now we're going to put the weather. So open up Geek Tool, and drag a shell onto your desktop. All the codes are in the description, so don't worry. So paste the, the first code for the image, and see those quotations? That's where you're going to put the URL of your weather. So go to yahoo.com. It doesn't work with any, it has to be .com. It can't be .co.uk, it can't be, can't be anything else. So I'm just going to use Washington, D.C. for this tutorial. So what we're going to do here is up there I'm gonna copy the URL and then I'm gonna paste it between the two quotations and don't you can't delete this code because if not the picture won't work but this code basically just downloads the picture so we're gonna refresh it every every 20 seconds this next code displays the picture so this is the second code and we're going to refresh, you're going to put the same refresh rate. Then just arrange it how you want. Next, we're going to add the current weather. So drag out a shell and paste the next code. As you see here, it says P equals. This is where you're going to type in your weather code. So go to Safari, and this time we're going to go to weather.com. But it's the same weather source as Yahoo, so it's okay. So then I'm going to go, go into the search field and type in Washington, D.C. again, just like last time. And see up there in the URL, after right now, it says our eight character weather code. So I'm going to copy it, and then I'm going to paste it right after P equals. Again, a 20 second refresh rate. And then here, we're going to change the font. So we're going to change it to Helvetica New and make it ultralight. And then I'm going to adjust the font size and move it where I want. Here, we're going to put a two-day forecast. Again, you can see that there's P equals, and I'm just going to put the same weather code as before. Again, Helvetica New, ultralight. Now move the window so that you have more space for what we're going to put where the sand is. So, add a new shell, paste the code for the date, and then make it Helvetica New Ultralight, and make it the size you want. Next, we're going to add another shell for the time. Make it Helvetica New Ultralight, but this time make it really, really, really big. So, this is the last thing we're going to add. Add an image shell, and then click that button, and then find where you stored that sand picture that we cut out that we made a PNG. And then make it the right size so that it covers up the time and the date just at the bottom. Now your desktop's ready for summer. Are you?